what are shake up satellites peaks in xps spectra what are their origins for the experts sometimes it is quite difficult to recognize to identify these additional peaks these peaks cannot be seen in survey spectra we have to take the high resolution xps spectra to see these additional shake up satellite peaks let me explain in this diagram that how this shake up peaks appears and there is also another satellite peak that is basically called shake up peaks but these peaks do not appear in xps spectrum sometimes it makes the background of the xps spectrum so we know that in xps we simply bombard x ray on the samples and the core electrons emits escape from the sample in this electron we call photoelectrons so let's suppose this is the atom before ionization here and let's suppose this is oxygen here so we have the plus s two electron here the two s orbital two electron and the two p we have six electrons here so this atom is before ionization so when we bombard x-ray on these atoms and we remove the core electrons so that atom become ionized and this atom looks like that this is the atom after ionizations and we have the photoelectrons here and that photoelectron left the atom and because of that photoelectrons we get the xps peaks so so far things are very very clear but when this photoelectrons leaving the atoms so there is a probability that this photoelectron may excites another valence electron to another high level look here here we lost one electron here from this uh, orbital here is a photoelectron so when this photoelectron was uh, just going out from the atom so there is a probability that this uh, this electron may excite another electron to certain higher level and here from this 2p orbitals electron just excite to this 3p orbital here so because of this photoelectrons this electron excite to higher levels so we know that this photoelectron basically lost kinetic energy so when it lost kinetic energy so we know from this famous equations that this x-ray energy is equivalent to the kinetic energy of the photoelectron plus the binding energy here look now so when when the, this photoelectron lost energy so if this means if this is 100 here so this two has to make the 100 so when this photoelectron lost kinetic energy so the binding energy has to go up this is why these shake up peaks appear at higher binding energy here we know that the binding energy increases toward the left here now what is shake up uh, phenomena here now there is a probability that when this photoelectrons going out from the atom so it may take electron from this valence shield and completely throw it outside the atom that is basically we call ionization here we, we see here this this was the photoelectrons and when it was going out so it takes this outermost shield electron it's completely ionized here so we we, we know that these photoelectrons lost a lot of its energy because for this this is this is this one is excitations in this shake up here in this shake is basically called ionization so for ionization we need more energy so this means that the kinetic energy of the photoelectron decreases more and more here this is why these shake ups basically uh, peaks form here at a very high binding energy this binding energy is very higher because the photoelectrons kinetic energy decrease decrease and we get higher binding energy for this shake up uh, peaks here but these peaks are very very rarely appear and it's sometimes makes the backgrounds here these shake up satellite peaks both shake up and shake up phenomena uh, is a result of relaxation so so we know that in xps the photo ionization occur from one is electrons and then there is a possibility that the 2p electron can be promoted into 3p level during the process of photo ionizations and this 2p electron jumping from 2p to the 3p is basically called shaken up and this is why we get peaks and those peaks are basically called shaken uh, shake up satellite peaks and these peaks are usually appear at higher binding energy as i explained because the kinetic energy of the photoelectron decreases and the binding energy of the satellite peak must increase because there is no other way because we are bound here for the conservation of energy 
these shake up satellites peaks are apparent are most visible in system like aromatic structure aromatic structure means like the benzene structure uh, like the plane structure like benzene uh, structure and plane structure plane like the plane structures uh, where carbon make a chain with other carbon uh, atom like this uh, carbon atoms like carbon atoms so those structures basically called aromatic structures and such similarly like the unsaturated bond here uh, where the carbon make a double bond and triple bond so those, those are basically called the unsaturated bond here similarly the transition metal ions like the heavy uh, elements we call these transition metal ions like lead uh, copper and cadmium etc so this this pi to pi prime are uh, excite uh, transition mean here L like we explained that when the, uh, the when the photo electron just take electron from 2p to 3p here so this 2p is basically represented by pi here and this is basically represented by uh, pi prime here or pi uh, star here uh, when electron uh, jump from uh, 2p to 3p and that is basically we call that shaken up shaken up and we get peak here and those peaks are basically called uh, shake up peaks.